Hey, hello and welcome to today's GFG problem of the day. Hope you are doing well. So let's say today's problem, insert an element at the bottom of a stack. So what the problem is saying is we will be given a stack. Okay. And if you take this example, how it will look like? So four is at the bottom of the stack followed by three, two, one and eight. Okay. So this is the state of the stack. Now we'll be given an X, right? X equal to two, for example, right? So what they're saying is you want to ingest this element at the bottom of the stack. Okay. This element should be ingested at the bottom of the stack along with this ordering, whatever ordering we have. Okay. Okay. So now how we can solve this problem? Okay. It's an easy character problem. So what we can do is we can have a temporary stack. Okay. We can have a temporary stack and we can, we will move all these elements, right? So let's wait first. So we need to ingest as we know, X equal to two at the bottom of the stack. So here we took a temporary stack and what we're doing here is we'll, we'll push all the elements from this stack, right? From the original stack into this temporary stack. Okay. As you know, last in first out is the property. So eight will go to the bottom, right? So, right. Then followed by one two, three, and four. So we have, we have popped out all the elements from the original stack to this temporary stack, right? Now what we'll do is we will, we will ingest the X also in the temporary stack. Once, once this stack is, once this stack is empty, original stack is empty, we'll ingest two also in the temporary stack. Okay. Now it is done. So now what are we going to do? We are again, since, since this original stack, this original stack now, right? This original stack. So we will, we will push the elements back to the original stack again. So two comes out, right? Then four, then three, then two, then one and eight. Okay. So here, if you see, we have achieved what is, what has been asked, right? So two is at the bottom of the stack with the same order for the rest of the elements, right? So yes. So I hope you've got the intuition. Now, before going to the code, I would request you to subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much. Now, first I'm going to show you the Java code. Okay. Followed by C++. So let's quickly implement uh, the Java code. So we'll take a temporary stack as I, as I told, right? Okay. Now I will push all the, I'll push the original, uh, the, the elements from the original stack, right? Until the stack, the original stack is empty, right? So what I'm going to do temp dot add stack dot pop. So what I'm doing here is I'm ingesting into temp, right? The elements of the original stack, I'm ingesting into temp, temporary stack. Okay. Once it is done, so I'll also ingest the X, right? Now, which will be at the top of the temporary stack, if you see, right? So we had ingested X, which is at the top of the temporary stack. Okay. Once it is done, now what are we going to do? Again, we are going to. So now this time we are going to ingest the elements from the temp, temp back to the original stack, right? Add temp dot pop. So yes. And then simply we'll return the original stack. Okay. So let me compile. It's taking a lot of time. In this compile, let me submit now. Yeah, the test cases have been processed. Okay, I have requested you to subscribe to my channel. Now let's quickly see the C++ code as well. So here is the stack, right? Temporary stack we have taken. Then we are pushing all the elements from the original stack into the temporary stack, right? And then once it is done, all the elements have been ingested from the original stack. We are pushing the X into temporary stack, right? And then once it is done, we are all again popping out and ingesting in the original stack, right? From the temp stack. So yes, so this is the code. This is the solution. I hope you've got the solution. Please subscribe to my channel, like the video. Have a happy, healthy, and a great day. Thank you so much.